What's up, everybody? Jason here with jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2019 Bowman Draft Baseball Jumbo 8-box case break Pikachu's number one just sold out. It's a new release day on this December 4th, 2019. A very, very hot pros uh, prospect uh, hunting uh, product. First place to find the game's future stars. And again, uh, just a little FYI, no Washington Nationals in this break. Unfortunately, there is no cards. And just also another FYI, all Chrome cards ship. No paper-based unnumbered card ship will be donating these. So we'll kind of just skim through the paper base. I believe the paper number cards will be between some of the Chrome cards. And then here you go. Here's the list. Last spot mojo. Going to Tyler with the Cardinals. And then here is a jumbo case. So it's kind of funny. We're used to saying jumbo as the big one. And just hobby, but this is considered hobby, but it's called jumbo. And then super jumbo is considered like the jumbo version. And this one has, I believe, what, eight boxes? So I'm going to put some of these boxes right here, as you can see. You see it on the camera. Nick's going to be getting here very soon, and he'll want to pack stack and help me rip. So we'll put those right there just to kind of get them still on the camera. And they'll be right here. We'll put four boxes here for him to rip, and I'll leave four boxes right here. Just so we can have some room to still uh, go through some of these hits on camera. So there you go. The four boxes are right here. As you can see my hands. And then the other four boxes will be right here. You get three autographs per box. Now again, after this break, we do not have nothing sold out at the moment. So continue to sell out PYT number two if you guys want to continue to do Bowman. If you guys want to switch it up and do some Prism, there's still more than enough time. Hopefully Joe is feeling much better today and is going to be here at 2 o'clock Pacific, so in about two and a half hours. We should be able to get this done within an hour, especially with Nick's help. So that gives us a solid other hour and a half or so to uh, get another case break of this in, maybe a prism half case break, maybe another random teams of super jumbo. Let me make this screen a little bit bigger so we can see it better. Alrighty guys, so first box again, we're gonna kind of skim through the paper base. Should be just paper there. We're gonna donate that and then the paper numbered cards, if there is any, in every pack or box, will be mixed in with the chrome cards. And there's our first autograph for the Boston Red Sox, which is going to Jeffrey Goldberg. And then we got Marsh. These are not numbered, but they are colored, so we'll put that in a penny sleeve. It's a top load. And we got Alejandro Kirk. Hola.
250 from Mauricio. Yeah, I put those two right there on camera. Oh, the other four, I mean, so. And for the Pirates, Siani. Oh, four ninety nine. Pirates. Going to Chris. Amonteros to four ninety nine for the Oakland A's. I was just saying I was gonna fly through the table because there should be nothing numbered in there. And then yeah, the, it's in the, in the in, so. yeah, in between these. Castillo, the two fifty for the twins. We got redemption coming up. Draft picks, black refractor. Who's that black? This is out of forty nine. Was that forty nine? Oh. Cameron Mins Misner. What is that? I actually have to check this up there. And obviously, super refractor would be one of one, but. Oh, I didn't go to the Excel sheet, yeah. It's definitely Marlins, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cameron Misner. Alright, so that's Marlins. And John! <laughs> there you go, John. Investing purchased Angel Stadium and 153 acres around it for 325 million to lock up Angels. Oh, to 2050? Well, so are they gonna? I, I think the, are they gonna renovate it then? Is that what they're saying? Did the Anaheim mayor propose that, or was it the other way? Because there was at one point people were saying, "Where are they gonna play?" Right? Yeah. I think it's just a block. You know the click. You know the Clippers should probably move over there. I think it'd be more logical for them to go there. I don't know if they would build a stadium in Inglewood. In Inglewood or in uh well I guess think it was more possible than um Santa Monica. Yeah. They they're talking about Santa Monica. Yeah, I heard what well, the guy proposed it right off like the beach. Uh, I was like, man, and he said he'd fully funded himself. <laughs> that uh bomber. He was like, Yeah. Oh, Steve Ballmer. Yeah. It wasn't like some random guy. No no no, he said I will fund it. They made it like a little virtual thing too, I remember. Either in Santa Monica or in Inglewood. I was just like, what? All right, next box. There's Siani again. He must have dumb money. Well, yeah, remember he's like the co-founder of like Microsoft yeah, or something. Well, he's so, the richest owner. Right yeah, there. yeah. Him I mean, do you remember when he said it? Like as a joke, I'll buy him for two billion, and then yeah. he kind of just set the mark. I think I remember the Oprah Winfrey and that one group was like offering a one point like three or something. He's just like, yeah, I'll pay for it myself. I'm like, yeah, that's crazy.
junk the 250 yeah I mean there really is though I mean there's way more space there than in downtown Sean yeah if I'm Anaheim and I'm like the Ducks and the Angels yeah definitely kind of turn it into like a little downtown live I mean like a Anaheim live or something you know because there's so much space there like you don't ever have to worry about parking in for the for Ducks games or Angels games really There's just so much space out there. What a Peloton. Who's that? It's these things that everyone's freaking out about. Oh, I thought it was like a player. <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. Uh, Shay, out of 50 Bowman's first, was that Lang Langiliers? Yeah, some guys were. Tyler was saying that some of the ones I pulled in the Super Jump will go for hundreds of dollars. Yeah. Like that JJ guy from Miami? Um, JJ Blade. Yeah, Blade or something. Oh, that one, the slap shot. I think I've seen it a little bit with my brother, but I was younger when he showed it to me, so I wasn't really interested. Because it's kind of like a dirty, well, not a dirty one, but. Yeah. Oh, I just left it there. Yeah, no, it's, I guess it's early. Oh, yeah, I guess so. Yeah, it's on network. Well, there you go. Exactly right, Sean. Five minutes away from property value is definitely going to go up. And Antoine Kelly for the Milwaukee Brewers. Going to uh, John A. Can you have foot surgery now? Yeah. I know, dude, he's all messed really up. up. This is the time to do it since he got shut down. Might as well try to get as healthy as possible. They were saying the Eagles should hire Ron Rivera as like a defensive coach or off or one of those. You know? But then, you know, if Doug, you know, if they start to lose, then they'll be like, oh, fire Doug. You know, yeah, exactly. You know, he should, they, it's not all his, it's not all his. He's giving them the plays. Like that Zach Ertz touchdown, he should have caught it. Zach Ertz had three drop touchdowns yeah. that day? Like, you know, those make a big difference. Because even Jake Elliott too. misses that field goal, too, you know? I like Zach Ertz, but I don't know. I wouldn't, because I think he's, I think he can get out of his contract this year or next year. Uh-huh. I don't know. Just lots of pay for a tight end. Yeah. Like I said, you still have Goddard, too. Yeah. Around, yes. Blue to 150 yeah, paper. Yeah, you know. Yeah. Except that's... Although, he almost blew the Super Bowl one, too. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I remember that. Reaching over the state. Yeah. Alrighty guys, you guys can see it. It's coming in the picture now. This is all one box here. I opened up the Super Jumbo and I was scared. I was like, wow, this is a lot of cards. <laughs> I know. Oh, crazy. Jameson. Like a little wave. You've opened that before. Right? To 150. Yeah, it's been a while though. Yeah. I was even tripping out on the packs. So I was like, whoa. They're like stuck together. Yeah, yeah. It's been a long time since I opened up the draft. They're like signing these packs. Yeah. D-backs, Calvin Chang with that one. Damn, he's already going to break Michael Vick's record and he's only like four games out still. And I 
Yeah, so I think if Vic played in today's NFL, he'd be better. Yeah. Well, like I said, if he didn't have those couple years in, in jail, yeah. those hiccups, he could have added so much more stats. Because that happened right in the prime when he's just like killing it. Paper out of 50 gold. Seth Johnson. I don't hate Gus Bradley, but like the Rivera. Yeah, I know, exactly. Ron Rivera's a good coach. I mean, look, at after a while, he's, he was there for 10 years. I didn't even realize that. You know, after a while, kind of just got to make a change. Even though it may not always be entirely his fault. Yeah, I just think they should have waited until after the season. Yeah. And what's the point now, you know? Yeah. Like, you're not going to go get another coach. Or yeah. I guess you open up your vacancies so people consider you. Yeah. Bryson Scott for the Phillies. The new owner, though. He doesn't. Yeah, he was like. He was like. No, like, I, I'm, I'm not guaranteeing. <laughs> yeah, I'm not guaranteeing that we're gonna be the best team in the year, but. It's like, man, you can't make the playoffs every year unless you <laughs> turn into the Patriots. Exactly. Their MVP quarterback out there too. Little Waters. Oh, it's funny. Did he switch jerseys with somebody? Is that all his, like, gamers? Because there's a mixture of jerseys there. Who is that? I don't know who that was. The guy played for the Bills, though. Little. For the Dodgers. J.J. Goss. Another redemption. Chrome draft picks autograph. Blue refractor parallel of Matthew Lugo. I think that's a Detroit, right? It's the same guy? Oh no, that's Dual Lugo. Lugo. Yeah, Seth Lugo, right? You have the keyboard over there. Oh, yeah, that's right. I can just look it over here. Seth Lugo's a match. Yeah, that's right. Matthew is Red Sox. That's Blue Refractor. Red Sox. With that one. Bryson a slot is a good one too as well. Nice. See Tyler's there earlier, I'm gonna hit the super practice I'm like, if I get enough cases, I hope I do. I, <laughs> I was like, these bricks are long. I don't think Joe's here to three, so maybe. Yeah, so maybe it. Yeah. This one is numbered actually. Oh, watch out. Out of 250, that is a triple, which is all Texas Rangers. We need more, more toner. Yeah, this time it's actually really messing up. Like that whole black smart snake is finally gone, but I don't think Joe's replaced the toner here for like a year. No, we did. It's oh, you did? Oh. Why don't we let it run? Because of all his toner scams. Alrighty, awesome. Next one.
Out of 250. Death Rage. Out of 150. Pessinger. Astro. And we got Jansen. Part of stuck together. Out of 499. Did you see the McDavid video I made? No, I didn't. You made a McDavid video? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I rewatched it finally late last night when I couldn't go to sleep. I was just laughing because I'm like naked over here. <laughs> I made it edited and so. Oh, that's cool. I know, it's better than watching the 40 minute video. And it's only a minute, yeah. Alrighty. I got like crazy people calling me for this card. I know, dude. <laughs> Some more people online and everywhere. It's crazy. <laughs> oh, I didn't know that. <laughs> That's my like perfect line. Funny. I should have said that card's gold too. That was crazy. That was so fun. Yeah, go tell your dad. I'm sure he's very eager to talk to you. <laughs> Once you're done or whatever. And we got Coach on Hawks for the A's. Out of 250, Contario. Adley Rutschman. Oro's going to Ken. Nelson. Out of 99, Golden. Man, it's pouring out there. Kissinger, out of 499. Rutschman right there. And Baum. For the Oakland Athletics. Michael Coons. Alright guys, I got one stack here. And there's three stacks actually right here. So let me actually move this one in the view of the camera. That way you guys can see the four stacks. So we're halfway through the break, folks. With Nick Pack stacking, it did make this break go by a lot quicker. So we should be done within uh, the next 20 minutes. And JJ Blade. That's a nice autograph. Too. That's a good one, supposedly, right there with the Marlins. I te you took yourself out of the group? Oh, I texted you the Joe's thing in the group message. Yeah.
And who has the Marlins, actually? John does, actually. There you go, John. Adding to your nice collection already from yesterday. That went to that. And for the Rays, Jeffrey Goldberg. Four ninety nine, Keed. Franco song damn I know I heard it right now I was like geez Out of 499, Jung. Out of 250, Fernandez. For the Rockies. And Mears. To 99. San Diego Padres going to John. Amenteros to one fifty. Ooh, I think we got an orange coming up. And it's a paper orange Stewart. Alrighty guys, three more boxes. Two fifty for the Phillies. Alex with that one. At a one fifty, dry pull. Already Vanilla Gorilla. Perfect time to do it too. Since there's not many people watching. Out of 499 Mears. 
Bowman's first. Another one for the Potters and John. Yeah, well, the good thing is that this is the jumbo case. And when Nick pack stacking, I should be done within 40 minutes. So that is perfect time, actually. Because, yes, without Nick's pack stacking help, it probably would take me about an hour, an hour and 15 minutes each break. But with him helping out pack stacking, that definitely cuts the break time to half. I mean, it took me 40 minutes just to do three super jumbos by myself. Also, I was taking my time because it was the first break, but still. But all the breaks today, besides maybe Obsidian, are going to take between 40 minutes to about an hour. Same thing with Prism Basketball. Pricester. But obviously, we can still mix it up, do that last two uh, spots we need to fill up to unlock Transcendent. We can break a Transcendent still tonight as well. Um, I mean, there's a lot of things we can still do tonight. That Black Diamond Hockey is really close too. Who does Andrew Vaughn play for, Deep Porter? And I will tell you if we pulled any. Jensen. White Sox? Uh, well, at least maybe not in this break. I'll have a little hit recap video, but... I don't know. I, I did pull some White Sox hits in the in the Super Jumbo. I just don't know if they were this guy, Andrew Vaughn, or not. I don't think so, though. Is he a good prospect? I have no clue on most of these prospects here. Out of 150? Red Sox? Pal, out of 499. Top five? We're selling anyway? No, that's good. Ed. I need to know who's the top prospects that sell well. <laughs> that way I know to get excited if it's a good hit or not. Well, that's for sure. Alright, guys, two more boxes. Alrighty guys, two more. Yeah, Adley, CJ Abrams, Blade Day is the top three that I knew of from earlier. Now I'm going to add Andrew. Wow, what is this? A dual autograph. Franchise Futures to 99. And that is JJ Blade Day. And Cameron Minzner. Wow. That's cool. And who is this going to, guys? John. <laughs> there you go, man. I guess so, EA. I didn't realize I was a Marlins fan. We got Lewis to 250. <laughs> Out of 50, Nova. Yeah. 
And Wyatt. Giants going to lead. A low dolo. Low dolo. Jung are also good hits. Josh is saying. Cool. Yeah, you guys need to definitely educate me. I know Joe will probably be more uh, uh, knowledgeable in the baseball field as he watches it much more than I do. Shoemake. But uh, still pretty fun to always break this stuff. Rivera. And wow, Mariner Gregory Kirby. Class of 2019 for the Mariners to 250. 156 to 250. Mariners going to Sky Dunn. Sharp looking card. Mauricio out of 50. <laughs> Aurelius to 250. Four ninety nine Prado. Alrighty guys, last box everybody. And well there's your guy, Sean. Kyron Paris to fifty. Paris, sorry. Durrell with the Angels. There's a purple. Seventeen years old, man. Adley, number one, breakdown. It's crazy if he is seventeen years old. Fitzgerald. I wonder how much they get these kids to sign for. Wolf to four ninety nine for the Mets. I wonder how much they actually get these kids to sign for. Penny's probably on the dollar. <laughs> Let me actually clear this up a little bit.
That's crazy, right? I've always just fascinated on how, you know, internationals and, and obviously just here in the United States, they get their signing bonuses, bonuses like Kyler Murray, getting like $5 million just to like say that I am going to play with you guys, right? Obviously, he turned it down, but like that's how baseball, that's how you know baseball has so much money is that they pay these prospects, whether it's a million or not, close to a million. I know it's not everybody, but pay them all that and they don't even know what they're getting just yet because again you can be a stud as a 17 year old right but then all of a sudden it just doesn't work out I'm sure it's happened to a lot of players but it's pretty crazy to think about it's 250 what but i guess if you're getting a million dollar signing bonus you're pretty much a big stud right it's like jock peterson i think he talked about it that Jock Pearson was supposed to go to USC to play baseball, but he got a like a million dollar contract to sign with the Dodgers as an 18 year old, and he decided to forego it. It's like a million dollars is a game changer. Why it again? All right, so looking for one more autograph out of here. And King, uh, Quintana for Detroit. It's going to Tyler. Wilson. J.J. Abrams, or C.J. Abrams, sorry. Thinking of the director. Ben, what's going on, buddy? No, not, not anymore. They have settled down. Oops. Uh, John actually doesn't need to fly out. He is in the Southern California area, Matt. That makes it even sweeter. He's going to pick it up in person. Alrighty, guys. And there you go. That was the break. So I'll go through a little break recap. Although there's a lot of people that are offering over six figures to come fly out to buy that from him, though. All right, guys, so we got all these numbered cards that we're going to top load as well. So just kind of skim through them. But a lot of different teams. So if you didn't get any autographs as you were watching, you may get something here. Remember, all the Chrome card ship inserts. No paper base does unless it's numbered, so that's why it's already penny sleeve. And here were the autos out of this break here. So our most recent one is Quintana for Detroit. We got Wolf for New York Mets, Paris for the Angels, Class 2019 Kirby for the Seattle Mariners, Wyatt for the uh, Giants, a dual autograph for the Mariners that features Blade A and Minster to 99, Jensen, Mears for San Diego, Baylor for the Phillies, Mears again, uh, John D for the Rays, Blade A again for the Mariners, Bomb, uh, Jack K for the uh, Angels. I'm not even gonna try with some of these names. Jensen for the Cubs, a redemption of Matthew Lugo, Blue Refractor. Stop. James Jameson to 150 for the Cardinal. Oh, sorry, for the Arizona Diamondbacks. Kelly for the Brewers. Uh, Langeliers, gold to 50 for the Atlanta Braves. Siani, a redemption for Cameron Minsner out of Miami, Black Refractor. Siani again, and one for the Boston Red Sox there. 
There you go, guys. This was pick your team number one. Let's get number two going unless it's already sold out. Jaspiescasebreaks.com.